morning everybody. Here was everything. Hope everything's going great because everything here is going incredible. Absolutely loving my time here. So it's been near, well, it's been over a month I've been here and I'm absolutely loving it. Just all the work with all the cattle. If you can see over there, bulls. And it's just so much fun. So woken up, had my breakfast, had a shower. And I'm going to do my first job of the day, which is to check out the wieners just to see if they're all in good condition and hopefully they have enough hay. But before I say wieners more often, I don't want you guys to go be like, oh, he just has wieners. <laughs> I'm not talking about what you guys are thinking. I'm talking about young calves. Yeah, young calves, not what some of you would be thinking about. So yesterday the wieners just ate all their hay. So therefore I need to get this bad boy and I need to pick up some hay for them. And whilst I was talking about that pre previously, but I didn't want to put that clip in because I got distracted by this bull. And yes, thankfully, that bull just walked into his field. I just opened up the gate and Tom just drove the cob bike and he was like, oh God, I'm in trouble. So he just walked into the yard. So that was an easy job for me. So now I'm gonna do what I was planning to do. Get this bad boy and give them some hay. Kind of a change of plan because I haven't actually done the hay bales for the cattle, the wieners, because there's a lot of jobs to do and I haven't done the hay. So now, well, I've just done a job with Tom because he needed some help because someone bought 26 heifers. <laughs> Me and Tom had to sign them up and then say, right, you can have them. So we allowed them to take these heifers. And then now we've got to get a mixture for the bulls who haven't been fed yet. So I have to leave this job to a side. Hurry up, you, come on. So we have to move them. Right, what was I saying? Yeah, so now we've got to get a mixture for the bulls, which involves that forklift. So I have to leave that to a side and do these hay for these guys left. But there is a small amount of hay, so it'll be a good job for them to eat that whilst I put a new one in. But now, just gonna put them back into their paddock and then gonna make a mixture for the bulls. <laughs> Basically what happened was, I was planning to put that with the wieners, but before I do that, because Tom's here and obviously he needs some help, so I'm trying to put some hail bales with some mixture which has got like protein, minerals and vitamins for the bulls. So we're going to put them in, load it all up, mix it all up, so it's ready for him to pull it around to the bulls, whilst at the same time I'll do the wieners to make sure they have hay. So we're trying to do two jobs in one. I don't know what Tom doing at the moment, so I might need to quickly go over and start cutting the hay bale. So I'll see you guys soon. the hay 
is completed, which is great. And all the wieners, well, the heifers that we put out that I was hurdling, well, I wasn't hurdling, I would say the dogs. Hello, Spook. <laughs> So yeah, they're all hurdling it, which is great. They're all just standing there on the field eating the grass, which is superb what we want them to do. Slowly get adapted to outside. And what do you want, Spook? Okay, you want me to throw the stick? Okay. I don't know why I made that sound, but I did. Anyway, so all the hay's done. Now the mixture, luckily, has mixed and it's all perfect. So that's what Tom's doing over there. He's putting the mixture into the pails, the pails, the pens for the bulls to eat, which is superb. And Spook's back. Where's the stick? Put it here. Come here, Spook. No, to my hand. This is the one thing I love about this dog. He passes it right to your hand. Whee! And I'm back with a nice cup of tea. I'm looking forward to this so much. But sadly, we have run out of milk, but it's not stopping me drinking tea. I'm so happy I am drinking tea again. It makes me feel an Englishman as always. So yeah, so now I'm just having a tea break. It is around lunchtime. We had a bit of a lunch as well, which is quite nice. For some reason, my phone cut off. Don't know why, but it just did. I don't like this way angle I'm doing it. I might just do it the other way around. But now I'm upside down. Hopefully that's better. So now I'm here with Standy, the cat, who's been on my bed for the whole day and for the whole night. So yesterday I struggled, didn't understand why he was sleeping on my bed until I found out now that he sleeps on beds. And he's moved over from my boss, Sir Tom, to my bed. So, I'm happy with it. Stampy. Stampy. You right? Oh, this is so cute. And I'm back. Welcome back, guys. So now I'm outside doing some hurdling because we had a wild alert. Because two cows and two calves have escaped their paddock. So I'm off to try and get them back into their paddock. If you can see them running away from me. So that's they are. And I'm trying to herd them back. And then there was also a bull that is around as well. And Tom's off doing him whilst I do them. They're back in their field, all sorted. Now let's go back and head and help Tom out. Put up this fence, which is pretty much a basic blockway for a road because the bull we're trying to hurdle is a bit mental on the head. So it's crazy trying to run around and want to go back to the group I put away. So I'll show it to make sure there's a division between them both, which is great. So now I'm gonna go over and help Tom out because he's struggling a bit. So I'm gonna go over and help. Now he's calm and quiet because he's with a mod, not just on his own. So 
is always a good sign for that. So he's quiet, which is great. And now we're just going to put them back into the main yard and sort them all out. <laughs> Just finished a whole day's worth of work, which is awesome, absolutely amazing. Loved every minute of it. The ending was a bit slow and a bit quiet and a bit quick because Tom had all the accountant work, so I let him off doing all that while I read my book, waiting for him to finish it. Well, I wouldn't say I finished, well, not me finishing my book, him finishing his work. And then we just did bits and bobs. So like this morning, the bull escaped, we didn't know how, so we fixed up the fence. Well, so everything here is great, all sorted. Now I'm just here relaxing with all three dogs around me. So there's Lily right there, and then there's Bob. Hello, Bob. And then there's Book out there somewhere in the distance, if you can see his tail wiggling. And now I'm hungry and I'm going to a pub and get some food. Sounds good. A few days later, I'm back. Yeah, so I completely forgot I had to do the ending for that vlog. And yes, the pub was amazing. The food was so good. I absolutely loved it. And it was probably the best meal I had at the pub. So I might just continue to go to the pub and get that same amount of food. Well, the same meal. So I apologize. I didn't do it at the same time, but I'm doing it now. So stay awesome. Keep smiling, make the best of it. Toodle pip.